Welcome to BudBook.org. You made it. Welcome to BudBook. What's BudBook.org? I'm sorry, this may sound silly, but I've never heard of BudBook.org. What? Welcome to BudBook, your free online social network for cannabis. For cannabis. Hey guys, Just Think Big here with BudBook.org. I'm doing cloning today. I like to use little styrofoam cups for my new clones. I have a few clones here already with roots from Aeroponic Cloner and these are going to be donated to uh, Guten High. Uh, these are Northern Lights number five crossed with haze. So starting off with a styrofoam cup I like to use styrofoam because they're inexpensive and flexible and so it's very easy to remove the uh, plant root structure without damaging it very much when you do the transplant. So. I use the bottoms here and you have to have drainage. These don't come with holes for drainage because the manufacturers don't know what we're using them for. So I just take my fingernail here and just take chunks out just like this and I take four and I take them spaced individually apart or evenly apart rather so that way you kind of have an even base of these little marks here. That way it can sit stable. If you do too big or too many, it's not going to be stable. And it might look like it's stable, but when you bump the table, it's going to fall over. So it needs to be stable. All right, so let's put some soil in it. We've got the aeroponic rooted clone, and we're going to throw it into the cup of Sunny Mix 4. Doesn't matter what type of soil it is, obviously. Now, since I've got such a long stalk here and a long root, I'm going to put minimal amount of uh, soil in there. That way I'll have a good sturdy structure and I don't want it topping over and whatnot. So this is how I roll right here. You take the inside and you just, you're just you swirling it in evenly as best you can. Try not to let the roots touch um, first off. See what I'm saying? Not really, because it looks like crap, but... Give it a little structure. Fill. Shake the soil down and ever so slightly push down eh ever so slightly cuz this is delicate here it's like that that's it boom done and she's cloned ready for guten high and for the treatment we are going to use alpaca worm castings the veg power and on this first water here guys you can never water too much but with an aeroponic clone you can water too hard when you transplant this thing into soil this thing is wet wetter than spaghetti it's like wetter than wetter than just so wet right so you gotta be careful it, it can smash we've got perlite in here and many other rough surfaces that when they get wet they get heavy and they get you know what I mean so be careful when you water be gentle and if you water too hard your plant will tell you in about an hour and a half to two hours it'll just buckle it'll scream at you now we've got sufficient run all four corners so then we know it's all the way around the whole cup and that's a good water it's always free it's always fun all the time so sign up let's go